Hello and welcome back to Subnautica. Today, I haven't actually released the last episode yet. I'm not playing two in a row. Uh, it's it's literally the weekend. Um, literally a couple of days before the next episode comes out. But I'm so excited about that episode that I really just want to jump straight in. Now, I had an idea. As you know, I did open up the map um, when I was going... Ooh. Okay. I did open the map when I was going to our friendly neighborhood place over there. The Aurora. Now, I realized something at that time. And that was, quite simply, that, like, there's another part of the map that is devoid absolutely devoid of anything scary at least it is on the map I don't know if it's true or not so I've got in my head I really want to go see what is in this place and strangely enough it's actually pretty close to somewhere we've been before and I'm hoping today we can go there and I'm like but you just you just got all the prawn stuff y yes but I'm afraid of skipping to the prawn suit. I could make it right now, technically. But I have a feeling that I might want the other one too. So we're going to spend a little bit of time today. Hopefully, a little bit of time today. Uh -oh. Ooh, I forgot how damaged you were from last time. There we go. So I thought we'd spend a little bit of time, hopefully, unlocking. There we go. Micron 19 is the one close to where we're going. So, I thought we'd spend a little bit of time, hopefully, unlocking the Colossus. Um, now, I don't know if I'll be able to build the Colossus. I, I'm pretty sure I can build the Prawn Suit, though, once I'm done. But I'm not so sure about the Colossus. So, not Colossus, whatever it's called. Is it Colossus? Cyclops. There we go, Cyclops. Um... Sorry, but that was in my mind. Ooh, what is that? What? Are you seriously telling me there's been something sitting so close, so close, this whole time that I haven't apparently gotten? I'll buy a reactor fragment. Thankfully, I have gotten that before. Excuse me. Can you just stop for a second? Yeah, there's something else over here as well. Let's go have a look what this is. Oh, I forgot how slow... Oh, see my fragment. Okay, good. I was gonna say, I was just like, you're showing me it's something I can scan, but like, do I want to scan this? It's another thing I should probably do is, uh, have my stasis rifle there so I can charge it while I'm swinging around. Alright. Well, first of all, let's go and, uh, hope I can find my way, because I've had pretty bad luck trying to find biomes recently, and last one I went to is quite dangerous. I don't know if this one is, but it does not have any leviathans in it. At least not that I can tell on the map. There's no skulls. So that should hopefully mean it's a nice, safe biome. Right? Now, according to the map, from what I can see, if I go past this area here, and slightly to the right, I will reach a brand new biome. Ooh, it's getting... Really dark. Okay, let's go down deep as we need to. Okay, so we've been here many times before, and I've always been afraid of this place. I've always thought it seems too big and too, like, grand to not be terrifying. But so far, there really hasn't been much problem here. Is that a... Is that a bloody time capsule over there? No, even worse. Is that a, is that, is that a thing I haven't actually unlocked yet? No, but it's definitely letting have a lot of light. Alright, so. According to my general thought process, if it's here, that's the, that, the biome I'm looking for should be just over here. Now, obviously, just because there's no leviathans doesn't mean there's other things that it's not good. Okay, that could actually be bad. Um, well, I actually don't know if this is the place to be or not. Uh, I think... I think. Oh shit. Whoa, what the hell is that? Okay. Okay, let's just go down. 
But that, that, that is not the right biome. But that is definitely a way down to the biome I was scared of before. Uh, let's see here. Oh god, um, please don't teleport me out right now. I'm trying to go for something less scary right now. You see, there's an alternative way of getting down there. That's helpful. Hey, what's this? This appears to be another wreck. I don't think I've been here before. Whoa. This is a big ship. Doesn't look like there's anything scary around. So... Alright, let's uh, go down. What is this? Nothing. Literally nothing. Okay. Alright. Oh boy, am I gonna regret this? Let's uh let's... life on the sea floor suggests this may be the migration path of a huge bottom dwelling life form. Uh Okay. Not a dangerous bottom dwelling life form. What did also did I just happen to leave my torch somewhere? Oh damn it. This is a great place to be exploring then. Oh, it doesn't actually seem like it's that Ooh, Cyclops Bridge Fragment! Okay! That's good. That's that's what we're looking for. So uh, this is definitely what we're looking for. Not sure why it's. Wait, seriously? That's all I was waiting for. That that's all I was waiting for. Okay. You know what? You know what, game? I didn't realize that was all I was waiting for this whole bloody time. Picture frame. What? Okay, so I was going to go on this big long journey to get Cyclops parts, but like it seems like I've already gotten them. I guess I must have gotten the fair amount of stuff I needed before, but still. Ooh. Propulsion arm fragment. Okay. And it's another one I already have. Okay, well, this has already been very successful, yes. Uh. Okay. I think I've already done that one because this said uh, acquired, so let's just keep on. Well, yeah, I'm not sure. Okay, I guess I head straight back and build the Cyclops and the Prawn suit then. Is there even any reason to go into this new biome? Like, that was pretty much everything I came here for. We I mean, might as well look inside and see what's here, but like. Here's something to point about. Oh, I don't even know if it's because I'm so deep or if it's because of something else. That's still a propulsion arm fragment, so it won't be there. There's a lot of stuff here I've never seen. Whoa, fuck! Where are you? Where the fuck are you? There you are. Oh, whoa, what the fuck is that? Oh, yeah, it's one of those things up close. Can I kill you, you piece of shit? Okay, you just teleported away. Okay. Um. So maybe this place isn't as, dan is, as danger free as I thought it was. I wish I had my torch on me right now. Maybe I've got put in the in the seam off. Did I put in the seam off? Maybe I put in the seam off. Okay. Storage, storage. Nope, I literally just do not have the torch on me. Fantastic. Um, this is way too dark for me. So, maybe we should just go straight up and try and go back towards the life jacket. Right, life rock. Uh, because it does actually seem like we got what we needed. Amazingly, that was very, very quick. We can build the Cyclops now. That was all we needed, huh? Now one piece. My whole plan. I have been thinking about this. Okay. I don't like that very much either. Let's go back up to the surface entirely. I've been thinking about this. Literally. I have been literally thinking about this all week. Being like, ah, oh, if that area has the Cyclops parts in it, I could go there and 
get lost little bits. I'm sure I only need a few bits. How bad could it be? Oh damn it's Oh damn music, will you stop being so scary? Just swimming over biomes right now. Even if I'm swimming over something scary, it shouldn't be that bad, right? Okay. Okay, it's getting lighter. Whoa. What are those whales? Yeah, back in back in friendly territory. Okay. I really hope either the Cyclops or the Prawn suit is just like really has a massively powerful light on it because uh, I should not have went out dark at night. I don't think I was out for that long, but apparently... Okay. Well? Of course it's singing. It's creepy singing. Thank you, game. <gasps> okay. Let's build the Cyclops then, and uh... Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Build the Cyclops, we'll build the Prawn Suit. I hope I can build both of them, to be honest, but uh... Oof. Why does it want to scare me right now? Okay. First of all, where the hell did my torch go? Oh. Fudging great. <sighs> All right. All primary systems online. Sheesh. Yeah. Okay. Lots of, lots of that, but still no torch. Seriously, where the hell is my torch? Did I drop it last episode? And not realize. So I wonder if I literally just, uh, you know. Drop my torch last episode. Or if I'm just blind, it could be my inventory for all I know. Ah, there they are. Ah, oh, okay. Seriously, torch, I should never go anywhere without you. Alright, let's go. Alright, first of all, let's see what we actually need to make these things, starting with the Cyclops. Oof. All right. Ooh. Wait, what? Can I just make the escape rocket? I doubt it. I've got to turn off the, um... Okay, let's go vehicles first of all. Cyclops. So, that requires quite a bit to the point where I'm just going to take a nice little snip of that. There we go. And I'll take a nice little snip of the Cyclops as well. Uh, the prawn suit as well. Oh, I need a lot of enamel glass. I do not even think I've got that much gel. But I think I have got the ability to make more gel, so we should be right. I'm just gonna go cut some, cut some of these things, I suppose. Oh, I still haven't scanned the deep streams. Huh. <laughs> all right. First of all, let's try and make the cyclops. So we need three plasteel ingots. Wow, it's even more expensive. I mean, of course, it's bigger. Okay. So let's start the thrust steel ingots. What does it actually require? No, it needs titanium ingots, which we should have plenty of. Oops, that's not the right place. No, it's here. Mm. All right. Equipment. No, not that either, but... Last steel ingots. Here we go. Um, nope. Advanced materials. Nope. Uh, this one. There we go. Last steel requires lithium and titanium. Okay, so lots of titanium ingots is the way to go. I might already have some of them, actually. So, if not, let's just grab as much of this as possible. Ah, uh, there's a little bit, and there's some glass, which I can enamelize. Speaking of enamel glass, is there any more enamel glass I have around here? Hmm. A lot of glass, so there's that at least. There we go. I will probably need the lithium, the, um, more. Okay, I've got a little bit of lithium. A little bit of lithium. Probably will need more. At least I know where that is. It's on the island. I haven't been back there in bloody forever. Okay, so. Titanium ingot. Titanium ingot. Alright, so that should be the three titanium ingots required for that. Um, for the... Yeah, titanium ingots. I have three. 
Okay, I just need lots of lithium, which honestly I don't think I have, but oh, I got some. That's actually, I might just have enough for the Cyclops, which would be fantastic because then I could take the Cyclops with me to get the uh, rest of the supplies. We'll see though. We'll see what I'll need. I definitely need more lithium though because who knew I'd need this much? I mean, probably anyone watching, but me. Yeah. Okay, that's fair. All right, one plus steel ingot. Two plus steel ingots. Three plus steel ingots. Alright, cool. Now I need three enamel glass. There's one enamel glass. Okay. And there's some more stalker teeth. And we'll need some more... Regular glass, which means we need some more quartz. Hmm... Really not sure which order I meant to do these in, so it might be that I'm gonna screw myself over by building this one first. I don't know. Okay. I need more enamel glass though, regardless. So glass and enamel glass. So I think you got plenty of stalker go out gel, huh? Glass. 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 There we go. Three glass. Then we turn to three. Enamel glass, one. Actually, two, technically, because I've already gotten that, but yeah, okay, never mind. I already picked up two, two of those. So I need lubricant, which is a creep vine cluster. Then the advanced wiring kit, which is a wiring kit, which is just silver. Yep, silver, silver. So two silver, two gold, first of all. So two silver and two gold. So there's some silver, there's some gold. I need a little bit more silver and a little bit more gold. There's some silver, there's some gold. Okay, cool. Now there's one more part to it, there's a computer chip, which I believe is a bunch of copper. So I can make the wiring kit already, fantastic. Alright, and then computer chip, which is copper wire, which is lots of copper, two copper, and two table coral. So I can get table coral from outside very easily. Let's just get two copper so I can make the copper wire. There we go, copper wire, and let's go and get the table coral right now as well as, as, well as that. So, oops, wrong way. Dive. I mean, it's quite the opposite of being welcome aboard, but okay. Okay. Grab one table coral, so you grab two table coral. Fantastic. Oh, this is kind of exciting, isn't it? Okay. Alright, alright. Oh, yes. Yeah, so let's also get the um, lead and the lubricant stuff now as well. Hello, creep vine. Can I just take a little bit of you? Yes, please. Yeah, I can just grab two. Uh, nope, full. Damn it, I bet everybody needs one uh, one creep vine cluster or I'm uh, be walking for no reason. All right, let's go here and create the copper wire, which can then go into the computer chip, which can then go into the, oh shit, need more gold. God damn it, okay, more gold. I've got more gold, it's fine. Another gold. Okay. Fantastic. More gold. Okay. We got some gold. So we now got an advanced wiring kit. Okay. Cool. So we just need the lubricant. There we go. And the three lead. One, two, three. So, I should, at this point, if I've done the math correctly, have enough to build my Colossus. Which is good, but not enough. So, let's go out there and hopefully build me a massive blooping submarine. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Um, can we just, like, turn you a little bit? Actually, I kind of... I feel like, I feel like that's not the place to build the giant honking submarine. Yeah, let's just uh, push this a little bit out of the way. There we go. That's, that's better. Much better. Point in that direction. Alright, so. Whew. Vehicles. Cyclops. Must be constructed in deep oh. Water. Well. Okay then. Um. Wow. Um. I hope that doesn't mean that I can't, like, pilot it through here. Alright, let's, uh. How big is this submarine? Now, I know, I realize I could just, uh. You know. Be, do the smart thing and like like suck it up and bl blow it back out again but like 
Oh, fine. Let's do the smart thing and suck it out and blow it back out again. I don't want to just spend half my video pushing it. <sighs> oh, wait. Can I? Oh, maybe I can't suck it up. Okay, then never mind. Let's just push it to the deeper water then. I mean, you're not going to let me... I mean... Oh, yes, also, change back to the stasis gun for a second. Okay, this has to be deeper water, right? There we go. Let's just push you this way. There you go. Push you out this way. Like, that has to be deeper water for you, right? Okay. Now. Oh. Be advised, the Cyclops is designed to be operated by a three-person crew. Well, far. Townspeople should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. Well, that's not great, but oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but unfortunately, it's also now night time. So, I mean, you know what? Like, if anything's going to hopefully not be terrifying, it's going to be in being inside this mother. Fudging beast. Holy hell. How big is this thing? How do I even get inside it? How do I power it? What do I do with it? Holy balls. I don't even know how to get in you. Holy hell. Maybe at the top? What the hell do you even, you even... Okay. Um. Brand? Maybe it's the bottom. Uh. Where is the airlock, guys? There is it. Am I... Right there, right? That looks like an airport airlock to me. But, like, apparently not. How... Okay, so I feel like maybe, you know, the three-person crew, crew ship is a little bit, um... Giant. And, and scarily massive for me. I don't even know how to get into this blasted thing. I'm gonna hope a lot of things. Okay, there, wait, wait. That looks like it could be. Nope. Um, there's like. Okay, can you look inside. It looks like it might be there. Which it is there. Oh, there it is. Board the Cyclops. Thank you. I wish you could be a little bit more clear. Okay. Oh. Oh my god. <gasps> it's all storage. <gasps> Holy hell. It's all storage. And a lot of empty space. And, and wow, even more stuff. Whoa. Okay, upgrades. Health, energy. Okay, so it's got six energy up, six upgrades. It's got three power cells in it. Holy hell, okay. What the? A decoy launcher. Launch decoys here. Okay. Oh, it's got its own. Oh. It's got its own vehicle docking bay. Okay, I was right about doing this one before the prawn. Got it. What the fudge is... Okay. Internal lighting on and off. Well, obviously... Why would I want it off? I mean, I guess... Run on sh slow lighting, but like... I'd rather that be slightly closer. Okay. Wow, it cuts a free fire extinguisher. I feel like that's not a bad thing at all. Oh wow, it's actually got its own scanner? <gasps> Engine offline. Well, fudge, how do I... How do we turn on then? Okay, it's a three-person ship, so... I guess I gotta find out where the engine is. God damn. Oh, so that's the exit. Okay. 
I mean, it's quite cool, yes. This must be the engine, but like... Also the upgrade bay? Huh. Maybe on the other side, it's gonna be in here. Oh, actually, no, it's six power cells. Oh, here we go. Wait, what? Oh, I've already got one of those, so I don't need that. Um, repair tool. Cyclops docking repair module. Wow. Repairs things while docked to Cyclops. That's pretty cool. Cyclops fire suppression. If I get crystallized sulfur, that sounds great. Meh. Shield generator. Depth module V1. Ugh, okay. It's alright, I didn't expect you to just be able to make your own shit, no. Not entirely sure how to turn on the engine, but... Very interesting. Okay, also, what can I... I it looks like it's big enough to build something in here. Like... Yep, it is big enough to build stuff. Wait, 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 does that mean I can build... If I could build a power cell shot, um, I feel like, huh? I I feel like that shouldn't work. Let's see, power cell charger in Cyclops. Yes and no. You need a Cyclops to. I found using a battery charger on board uses the mounts using the circle trial cells transfer the trials to the battery. Ooh, that's bad. Um you need to you need a cyclops thermal reactor upgrade before you can install any charges. The will drain the power from the thermal upgrade, but this isn't an issue. Okay, so unfortunately no. It does it does happen, but it's not really a, a great solution, so that's a shame. Although I could have... I could grow food in here, right? Like, if I get more titanium, could I... Could I place a... I mean, technically, one would imagine I could put anything in here. Like, can I put this in? Yeah, I could put some storage... Okay, never mind. Never need to upgrade the storage of the Cyclops. Apparently, I can just put my own bloody um, lockers in. Okay. So, that's interesting. If I could get a, a grow plot... Yep, I can get a grow pod in there as well. Okay, so I get, wait, does that mean, what if I could build a, another generator? Would that work? Is that something that happens? Like, can I build a, a bioreactor in here? No. No, unfortunately, I don't appear to be able to build a bioreactor in here. That is a shame. That is very much a shame. Could I build solar panels on it? Uh, no, I can't build that. Water filtration, no. Apparently, I can't build any of this stuff. Gotcha. That's a shame. Um, I'm gonna guess I can't, yeah, no. I'm gonna guess I can't actually um, build anything on the outside either. Like, I'd, it'd be very nice if I could put some solar panels on here. Okay. Um, I wanna still wanna work out how to get the engine on, so. There's something over here, let's see, that's health. Um, beep, beep, bop, beep, boop. Oh, here we go. Submarine. Oh my god, I can name it. I mean, it's egg. So technically, wouldn't that mean that, that like, if I do this, and then I do that, and then I do the green maybe to go with it. All right, and I could that white. Like, there we go. Right, there we go. Let's let's try here. So. There we go. Fantastic. I can name it the nest. But that doesn't actually help me any, does it? No, because I still don't actually know how to turn the blasted thing on. All right, engine offline. Oh, do I just press it? Oh, it's talking to me. Hi. Rig for start running. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I got cameras. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's so cool. Sound horn. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I still want to do one more thing first, but I mean, 
What else do I need? Aerogel, which I can make now. Enamel glass, dead diamond, plasteel. I don't know if I've got what I need to plasteel or not. So, I mean, is there any harm in taking this to the island? Like, and using its massive storage to get, like, all the stuff I need? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Can I raise and lower at all? Okay. I guess I could go weird landmass. I'm going to take a long way because I can't go through the shallows, I don't think. Okay. Because I need more... I'm going to need more stuff for the... The other one, I think. I, I think I'll still need some more lithium. So, I mean, if I didn't, I kind of just want to ride my brand new submarine. I am a little bit upset it does not have any way to charge it, though. So, ish. Oh, what the fuck is that? I mean, I think a lot of sound right now. I think the clients aren't running. Okay. It's kind of a shame what we have to see, but... Weird landmass, here we go. Oh boy, look at this thing. This is not what I was expecting. I wasn't expecting to just get this Cyclops up and running already. This is fantastic, though. I've got to say, I'm running out of power very quickly. Also... I don't know if I'm hitting stuff. Like, what does that mean? I don't know. What does that mean? Wait, that clearly means something's hitting me, but like... I don't actually know how to descend, either. Um... How the hell do I descend? Wait, it's part sub. What if I use, like, right click? Left click. Uh, nope. I do not know how to descend, actually. I mean, to be air phone, I won't need to descend. I just don't want to lose my sub, either. I hope it's mostly invulnerable. I'm not going anywhere particularly dangerous, I don't think. Just the island. Again, I've never been through it like this. And I think I'm about to fly directly over the flying islands, so... Oh boy, the floating islands. Yeah, but I can't actually get up. Oh, there, there's a bone shark over there. Doesn't seem to be paying much attention to me though, so... We might be right. Oh god, I've already lost 20% of my power and I've just been sitting at the surface. With my lights off! Holy hell. This thing drains power like a mother trucker. Okay, well, all I gotta do is find somewhere safe to park it. It's hopefully gonna be nearby here, because this seems like I might be right here. Oh dear, please don't lose this ship, is all I wanna say. Alright, here we are. This is the weird landmass. Now, hypothetically, I should be able to get everything I could possibly want from this main mass and like just take it back to my base right let's try and park in the shallows if we can I mean for one I don't know how to go down so alright let's turn off the engine alright let's turn back on the lights at least the interior lights or not Yes, I need to go back here. Ah, you know what? I'm just gonna leave it on low power mode. I feel like with how much the bloody things um, discharged on me, how much did they? 100, 100, 100. Okay, so it does seem to discharge them one at a time, at least. Zero. Ah. Or I discharged one power cell. That does mean, however, every time I go back to base, I should be able to um, take those power cells out, right? And like put them elsewhere, so... Oof, okay. Let's mark the Cyclops. Is it safe? I mean, I don't see any reason to believe it's not safe. Okay. Oof. 
Alright, well, let's go up here and try and get, hopefully, what we need. Now, thankfully, we do know very much about this island. And, in fact, it's been a while since we've been here. So we should be able to get a fair amount of supplies from here. Oh, yeah, I'm still holding some glass, too. Ah, well, it's fine. Keep eating the bubble trees, people! They're free real estate. There we go. Alright, so, there's my little mini base, which, uh, quite frankly, is, is pathetic. However, however, it might actually have some supplies in it that I can just take. It's probably not a bad start. Yeah, it does. There's lots of stuff I just left here because I had no reason not to. I probably don't need the cured fish. They can probably stay here, but everything else, like, yeah, let's take this straight to Cyclops. Like, apparently, it doesn't really matter how much we store. Oh, are you up on the land? Okay, more importantly, um, can I turn on a, a beacon manage for the Cyclops? Yes, it does. Okay, so the nest is there. Oh, it's right there. Wait, why weren't you showing up on the beacon management thing? Okay, you just not for some reason, but I'm totally on board with this. Like, look at that. It's not the most appealing um, color scheme, I admit, but <laughs> I think it gets the point across that it is my nest. Right? <laughs> like, I think it gets the point across, okay? <laughs> Thank you. I mean, granted, it does, not, it does not take very long to fill this su sucker up, but apparently I can build more stuff here anyway, so, uh, yeah. I, I see no reason not to just keep going out there and keep filling this baby up. Wow. I mean, as long as I stay away from it, it should be fine, right? I am, I am a little bit very concerned about the power situation. I might want to get some more power cells and have them for an emergency. Like, I should probably have a second or thir even third set of power cells somewhere in this ship. Just in case. But, for now, we might as well just gather whatever we can. I want a prawn suit, damn it. Alright, let's see here. There's um, some more. This is what we came here for, lithium. I don't know if this is what we needed. I just know I ran out of it before. Like, technically, I've got Sorka Teeth, so I don't need any more for the that. I've got enough to make the aerogel, I believe. I'm pretty sure it's a plasteel that I was having trouble with, but I actually forget what the plasteel actually requires. I just know I was low on it. Um, yeah, lithium. So fantastic. Okay, so, oh, and, and of course, more titanium. Which, I mean, feels like a little bit of a, a, a boring thing to pick up when I've got this gigantic ship. But, like, am I going to look gift, gift submarine in the eye? Probably not. Okay. I don't know why I'm swimming down here, to be honest. I don't even know if there's anything down here I need. Hmm. Those things look pretty. Well, I might... I don't want to scan you because I'm too lazy to get my scanner. I say lazy, but I'm also scared. It's weird when now I don't actually have my uh, ship near me. Oh, I do see where it is, though, so at least if I do get out of here... If, if I get out of here. What the fudge is that supposed to mean? Alright, let's go back up because it's clearly not like loads of resources on the walls down here. I think we got to go back up into the main island. Maybe we can even walk to, um... Now, once I learn how to raise and lower my submarine, I think I'll be pretty good, to be honest. I'm still terrified, but like... I guess now I've got to be... I think I'm going to look up... Because I'm I'm pretty sure if anything is going to be... A, I, I don't think as much is going to be worrying me in the Cyclops. I've just got to work out what can and can't attack me. I'm going to guess that the Leviathans can still deal damage to me. But if I see one of them, I can probably get out and kill it if I have enough uh, patience and time. Um, like, all it would, one would imagine all it would take is a um, bit of stasis rifling. So... Yeah, as long as I take down those, but like, I don't know, like, those big robot things, they, they seem to mostly be after me. I don't know if they're after my ship. I've never seen them attack my ship. The bone sharks, well, maybe they can attack me? 
Maybe they can do damage. I don't know. I think I've just got to look up and work out what can and can't kill me. You know? That is the most important thing at this point. To know. Oh boy. Well, at least um, we don't need to worry about food or anything down here. And uh, honestly, compared to when I first came to this island, which granted has actually been a very long time ago, I haven't been here for a very, very long time. Like last time I came here, I was a lot more afraid of everything. But now I've literally got so much. I don't know how much progress I've made, and I actually don't know what the next step is at this point. Um, but you know what? I think I'm doing pretty well for myself right now. I do have to wonder where the hell is the rest of the minerals. I mean, I got a lot, a lot every time I came here, so it's very possible we're running low. Now there's some. There's some diamond. Good, I'll need some more diamond. Diamond is required. I think we've already got plenty of it, but I'm never going to say no to more. thing is, at this point, I'm much less afraid than I've ever been, which is a weird one. And I don't even know how to pirate pilot this damn thing yet. I'm very much looking forward to whatever this prawn suit turns up being. I've seen a few wrecks, but like, what does it mean for me? Like, if the Cyclops is this huge and the prawn suit is the thing that people don't like, they don't like spoiling because it's so exciting. It's just like, whoa. I definitely want to get that prawn suit, suit built. But I feel like building the Cyclops first was the best, the best call. I think. I guess we'll find out when I, you know, try to pilot the... I, I gotta say, I was sort of expecting a bit more in the way of, uh, loot. But I guess I kind of got all the easy loot. It's very true, though. I got most of the easy loot when I was here before. I don't think I ever went up here, though, did I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I never went up this high before. Is there even anything up here? No. Well, that was wildly anticlimactic, wasn't it? Oh, wait, there's still more around here. Okay. I probably don't need this on, but I can now recover it. Like, when I was wasting actual batteries, it mattered more, but now that I can just recover it by swimming, it feels fairly mundane. Okay. Another tablet. I mean, I never found another alien base to use it with, but I guess I won't say no to it, will I? What do I hear? Yeah, I wish I knew why you couldn't build a bioreactor in the Cyclops. That just makes me sad. I'm kind of also a little bit bummed that I seem to have apparently gotten everything of value from this place already. I don't see anything else here. Have I seriously already, like, drained this place dry? Well, I guess I could go to the other big island, couldn't I? No reason not to. Hmm... I mean, as long as my Cyclops is safe down there, it doesn't really matter to me where I go. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, second diamond. That's all I need for the, um, for that. I think I've still got lead at home, but if not, I probably can find a little bit more lead before I go back as well. I could go through that portal. Yeah, I've got to, before I really use my, I think it's going to not be till next episode I really get used to the Cyclops, because I will want to Either some help or just some knowledge on uh, what the hell the site can damage me in the Cyclops. Oh wow. Now I know that's the side I entered from. It's kind of weird watching it, isn't it? Alright, let's go back in here. This should be the uh, chamber with the... Oh wait, this one works down there. I never go down this chamber, or it's just... I was always full of inventory by the time I got to this part. Gold is always good. Aha, that's what I was looking for. I mean... This is not where I was planning on going, but it seems to have everything I need, so... Does that mean I've never been down here? I thought we were going towards the, uh... 
I admit, I honestly thought we were going towards the um, portal, but then I end up turning out a different way altogether. Well, there's no terror, spooky, scary skeletons in here either, so... I mean, a lot of lithium here, so, like, have I been here? Let's make TV awake and jump back down to the water, I suppose, but wouldn't do want to do it on this side. Yeah, I haven't also, also seen many of those crabs. I can hear them clattering about. I haven't even seen my, my hide nor hair of them, though. Don't actually know if those good, they're good for anything, so... Bring a couple back, that's probably enough. If not, you know, the regret will be felt later. At the moment, I think I'm getting everything I need to. Now, this this um, area is surprisingly a lot bigger than I thought it was. Oh, there's a crab there. In fact, there's crabs everywhere. But they don't seem to be as scared of me, or I'm not as scared as them anymore as I used to be. Oh well. Might as well get more and more lithium. That is one gigantic bulba tree. I don't feel bad for taking this. Oh, inventory full. Okay, fair. I was wondering when that was going to happen, to be honest, but like... It hasn't happened fully yet, so I must have less than three slots left. There's one more. And there's one more. So, that must mean this next one. I'll just try taking lithium. Yeah, inventory full. Okay. Well, I don't see anything else we can really do, so... I guess i got to try and get back out of here. Wow, there's still a lot of um, supplies here. Okay, good to know. Good to know that I can still come here and get my crap. Uh, I, I'm actually actually literally shocked about just how much is still left in these caves we're definitely over the other side of the island now i should probably scan those guys huh now i'm less scared of them like that what are they gonna do hurt me that's gonna be another thing to pick up so there we go yeah. yeah i don't think i'm that worried about right now which is once again crazy to me Salt deposit. Salt deposit. And another tablet. I mean, at this point, I, I need to take it because it's so rare, but like, I guess I just dropped the first aid kit because that kind of, in, in, you know, that says something, doesn't it? Not only am I not afraid, but I'm actually dropping things I actively probably, like, is more immediately useful to me. Okay. Go get out of here again, so let's get try and get out of here on the side of the um where the Okay, the Cyclops is over there, so actually that was the right side. If I jump down to the water Hopefully I won't die. Like, is this a safe place to go down the mountain? No, I don't really know, but looks like there's actually a pathway, so There we go, there is a pathway down. Alright, good, good. Now, if I go this way. Ooh, let's not walk off into nothingness. Okay, there we are. And then to the water, which is hopefully, well, not totally safe. Um, I do have the stasis gun, so. And there's still a lot more supplies over there, too. Okay, so. Ooh. Okay, I don't like that guy being so close to my Cyclops. I also don't like the fact he's slowly going over there. So. I think it's time I do a little bit of spring cleaning. Actually, no. What's the time I scan this thing? Whoa, that's taking a long time. Okay, now, can I get it to go away? Yeah, it can, it's just gone away. Fantastic. Hopefully, nowhere near nest. Alright, my food and water supply is a little bit small. Yeah, I'm gonna guess the bleeder couldn't do any damage to it, so I'm probably fine on this thing attacking it. But it definitely can be attacked while I'm not here, apparently. 
Ow. Once again, I'm not that afraid at the moment because, you know, I've got a giant fucking submarine next to me. Okay, I am, I am a little bit concerned about the warper, I must admit. Right. Let's go back down here. We'll drop the... Oh, what? Oh, shit. What? How did you drain all that stuff? I, I left you off. I left you off! How did you drain everything? Should I take the power cells out of you and your bloody... Oh, God. How are you... Dr How? How are you already out of power? What the hell? How are you out of power? I seriously don't get it. I left everything off. Yeah, engine offline. All the lights were off. Engine powering up. Wait, what? I'm gonna say there's no power. Powering down. Oh god damn it. Well I have a cyclops now. Bloody hell. Okay, what the hell? How the hell does the Cyclops just drain all its own power? Drains... Own... Power. Vehicles recharge power from the Cyclops themselves. The empire does there. Oh. What? Silent mode apparently takes power. God damn it. Silent mode drains power when you think it would do the exact opposite. Fucking hell. Alright, well. Shit. Talk about a walk of shame. Oh, great. I. I. Okay, unload power cell. I just want to take all the power cells with me. Go get them all bloody well re Ah, god damn it. A note to self, never use silent running. God damn it. Oh great, and I gotta get out of here. Fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, 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 fuck. I'm dead. In my own fucking Cyclops, I'm dead. Wait, I'm back? It's apparently dying in my Cyclops doesn't actually count as death. That's that's handy to know. What the fuck? Okay, do I have my... Yes, I do have my Sea Glide, so... Fuck. Yeah. Let's get that going. Okay, Sea Glide. Ugh. So we got a brand new piece of furniture. That we can't use because I let myself run out of power. Oh god, I hope you'll be okay. Now, oh, what a great way to end the episode. Shipwrecked and stranded. It's like the start all over again. God. It was being like, oh yes, I've got the perfect way of getting back. I'll be I build my Cyclops. Uh, my thing at the end of this episode. Nope. Fudging hell. I mean, on the plus side, I can at least take Egg back. I can put... I can take Egg back, because Egg automatically charges. So... I can take Egg back. I can recharge my batteries. I can take Egg back there. And we can come back, full loot. Make the bloody, um... Shoot me, it doesn't get destroyed. I hope it doesn't get destroyed when something that far away from it. Oh, God.
I need a bloody manual. I could before I go back, let's also eat a little bit. So, um, sorry guys, but uh Ah oh boy. I'm just I'm kind of uh, I don't know how I feel like right, right now, but it's not positive. You know what? I've never picked those up before. Let's see if anything bad happens from it. I'm gonna throw in the bloody generator. <sighs> okay. I'm so glad I didn't go outside the Cyclops. If I had gone outside the Cyclops, that would have been an actual death. I would have actually lost everything. I'm going to need a few more battery charges too, aren't I? Well, I simultaneously got and lost my ship in one episode. In one bloody episode. <sighs> Please charge those. <sighs> Fucking Well, let's at least see. Let's at least see. Not the aquarium. Okay, if I put these things in. Well, I'm definitely doing something. Well, guys, this is less the triumphant end I was hoping for and more a monumental sadness. I got my Cyclops. I didn't get my prawn suit. I probably still could, but at this point, I feel like it would just be... I'll get it next episode. How can I go from being so high to being so low that quickly? I don't know. Quite frankly, I don't know. But now, you get the idea, I believe. We have done what we needed to do, I suppose. We got the last piece of Cyclops, we built it, and we're literally within a stone throw distance of the prawn suit. Oh yeah. Where's that Cyclops upgrade? Definitely has a Cyclops upgrade here somewhere. There it is. Wait, redu recycles heat byproduct to increase engine. Okay, sure. Uh, I'm just kind of disappointed by this turn of events, to be honest. Like, I definitely feel, I definitely feel a little bit let down. Just a little bit. And no, I definitely do not have the ability to build. I don't even have the ability to build the last bit of titanium. I guess I do. I definitely can't build the blast steel. Ugh. Life is painless. Yeah, lithium. Ugh. So, essentially, we almost got there. Alright, there's two aerogel. I need that. I don't think I've got any enamel glass, but I can make more. I just need to... No, I can't, because I left myself there. Oh. I can technically make more, but... I just... I feel like I made... Big mistake, number one. Oh, well... I need to work out there's something I could do to make that uh, less painful. 
I don't know what. Oh well. Thank you for joining me today on my mountain. Oh, not my mountain of shame. No, it's uh, on my Subnautica playthrough. And, uh, yep. It's um, quite the, the end, I suppose, for now. We will come back and I will do more, but it won't be for another week yet. Yeah, sigh. Look, honestly, we did well today. We just made a simple mistake that anyone could have made. So I shouldn't be too let down with myself. And quite frankly, we probably... Yeah, we can't do it because we just don't have enough of the one material we were going back for. We just had one, two, uh, three more. Three more. We'd have enough to build it right now. Damn it. Oh well, these these um, batteries aren't taking too long to charge up. We might want a few more char power charges at least. And, oh, I've actually got a bunch of power cells. Oh, they're, they're the cells I just got. Never mind, I'm an idiot. Um, yeah, that would be nice. Nuclear generator. Hmm. I don't know what my plan is currently. Try not to completely stuff up, I suppose. Oh well. I shall uh, see you all next time. Thank you for joining me. Let's save the game before I do anything else. There we go. Thank you all. Goodbye.